leave yesterday. You know, it's fucking cold back home. Did I hit my computer? My what? No. You're Broke my computer. You all right? Well, what a big weekend. Oh. <laughs> what are we doing now? We're getting McDonald's. <laughs> I'm so disgusting. What's your order? McChicken. Chicken nuggets. Wait, no. Junior chicken? What's the difference? It's just smaller. Which one do you want? Oh, I want a fucking big one. A McChicken. <laughs> a McChicken! A McChicken with pickies! Chicken nuggets, we share them. And a Coke. I know you want one. <laughs> Good morning. It is Tuesday. It's Sharon's birthday today. Wow, I look, look at my hair. Um, I'm running late as per usual. I used to be a person who was always on time, 15 minutes early, and now I'm literally always late. And yeah, I'm going to Uncle Shoot today. And it's just been a fucking morning, you know? So I'm just getting everything ready. I have to bring a bunch of stuff and we're gonna go shoot some Uncle looks. Black Friday's on Friday. It's just been really, really busy. We have so much content too, so. It's just been a bit of a nightmare. But we're gonna make it work. Let's, let's go. Let's go to the shoot. Yeah. We went to the gym this morning. That's why I'm, I don't know, not, my hair's kind of weird today. Yeah, we went to the gym this morning. Guys, we have a TV. Look at this setup. Watched uh, The Sinner last night, I'm watching The Sinner season two. Very good, didn't watch season one. Apparently season one's better, but yeah. So watching season two, it's really good. And today, oh, yesterday we did the uncle shoot. Kind of didn't talk to you after. I just had like a bunch of shit to do. Today we are doing something very exciting. I clench my jaw um, when I'm stressed and I do when I'm sleeping. When I'm stressed and sleeping. So I am getting Botox in my jaw to stop me from clenching because it's not like so, it's not super severe. I know you can get a mouth guard, but I'm just gonna do Botox because I'm not gonna sleep with a mouth guard, I know myself. So we're doing Botox in the jaw today. Well, yeah, we're gonna go and do that. <laughs> That's today. Right, like I have had fillers. Yeah, I, I some people it works really well. Mm -hmm. Most people it's not gonna do much other than make it feel weird when you use a straw. Okay. Uh, but it's not a lot of Botox, right? So right. Um, you know, we start with somewhere between two to four units of Botox, which is not a huge amount. So it's not like it's a big cost or anything to you. And, right. But I think if you're already having headaches, there's a high risk of causing TNJ dysfunction in the future, and that's going to be a much bigger problem. Okay. And the surgery, there's a high risk of injury in the facial nerve. Can you tell that I do it from touching my face? Like, can you tell? I can't. I can feel that they're very strong and hypertrophic when you but when you clench down. There's a lot of, and I can tell it's strong on this side. That's why I asked. Yeah. Um, but that could just be a normal asymmetry that this has stronger too. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I like this brush too. It's so it's nice. nice. This brush. It's our blend and buff brush. It's actually my absolute favorite brush. I love it. Because right now I'm using a, a Tarte brush. Yeah. But it's honestly this big. Yeah. It's and it's so like, happy. I can't yeah. travel with it. <laughs> Forehead. 
I haven't talked to you all day today. It's been a bit of a day. We went up to the Nude Sticks office and filmed some fun content. And now I am heading to go to Ikea. I'm gonna get some stuff at Ikea. I need to get bed slats and just some random shit. And tomorrow's Black Friday, so it's a bit of a hectic night for Uncle. Trin and I have put everything on sale. We're doing a 50% off sale, but this video, Black Friday will pass before this video goes up. But yeah, if you want to keep on top of what we're doing at Uncle, you should follow us on Instagram, Uncle X Studios. That is what's going on right now. I might bring my camera to Ikea. I'm going with my friend though, so I don't know if I want to be on camera, so. That's what's going on. We just put up, I'm on FaceTime with Sharon. We just put up our Black Friday sale and it is popping off 12 minutes in. You guys are really going crazy. We love it. We're very happy. We're ecstatic. Ecstatic. As, yeah, it's good. We have up to 50% off, which is wild. Biggest and only sale of the year. We actually don't, we don't put things on sale. So this is crazy. That's what we're doing tonight. I'm in my cloud coach, putting things on sale. <laughs> okay, so I'm ending this vlog off. Because I did show you that I got jaw Botox in the vlog, um, I kind of want to like run through all the things I've done to my face um, to just be like super transparent and honest with you. I feel like you have to do the disclaimer. I don't think you need to get anything done to your face to be beautiful. It's all personal preference. Friends. What I do with my face is my choice. It's my fucking face. What you do with your face is your choice because it's your fucking face. So whatever you choose to do with your face, no judgment here. If you don't want to do anything, if you want to do a lot of things, whatever makes you happy, not here to judge. So I'm going to run down things, the things that I've just done because I feel like a lot of you are interested. So first I'm going to talk about what I just did in this vlog, which was jaw Botox. This is not for aesthetic purposes. This was because I clenched my jaw. I was clenching my jaw so tight that I was getting headaches when I slept. I realistically wasn't gonna wear a mouth guard. And when I talked to the plastic surgeon, he said that I was a good candidate for it and it has helped tremendously. I can't clench my jaw as tight. Like when I used to clench down, you could like see the muscles like come out of my face because I was clenching so tight and my muscles were so strong. So I got jaw Botox in this video specifically because I was clenching my jaw at night when I was stressed. I do have ways to manage my stress because I know that's also going to be something that people say it was just something i was doing and i was doing it without like subconsciously so on that note i have also gotten forehead botox before as you can see can't really lift my eyebrows too much i don't get those lines that are natural i started getting forehead botox this year i'm 26 years old i'm turning 27 in a month not that that matters but if you were curious i got here and my frown line. Personal preference, I just want to prevent wrinkles. Botox can be pre preventative. I'm not a doctor, so I'm not gonna really give you advice on Botox. If you are interested, I would book a consultation and do whatever, so. I go to Dr. Pirani in Toronto. He's amazing, highly recommend. I think he's an incredible surgeon that doesn't go over the top and just like really gives you like a natural, like I can still like move my eyebrows and I feel, I don't feel like I'm like, you know, <laughs> I have gotten lip filler. The last time I got lip filler was early summer, I think. And I just get it in my top lip. I do have a whole video about it. I have a video about why I got it, but I just have gotten filler in my top lip. I don't know exactly what I get, to be honest. I went to JK Lips Boutique by JKA and I got 0.4 of a syringe. So you can either buy a full syringe or a half syringe and I buy half syringe and then I don't put the whole thing in my top lip. I just want a natural look. That's my preference. So that's what I get. On top of that, I do Forma Facial. This is a non-surgical facelift. I don't know why I did this. That's not how you use quotations. But can I just stop you right there for a second? When people do this, I don't really know what that means. Forma Facial is a facial, I get it at Tight Clinic, I will link it down below, but basically they just rub a machine on your face and it helps produce collagen, it tightens your skin, it kind of lifts your face, and I've definitely seen a massive difference in the way that I look, but it is just like a machine that they rub on your face. I don't get facials that often, but I have gotten IPL laser for my acne scarring, and sometimes I get lash extensions. So that's everything I've done. I just wanted to run through that quickly because I knew there's gonna be some questions because I didn't get gel Botox in this video. So that's that's the that's the honest truth. That's my face. So yeah, see you later. <laughs>